Morning guys, um, another wet day, 2014 now, January, led to another project coming to completion. This is the uh, ground tuner unit. Um, as you can see we've got, we've got inductance there, the plate is there, or capacitor, whichever way you want to look at it. You can adjust the actual meter sensitivity on the little controller here. And the meter there is out of an old um, CB radio. As you can see at the moment, we're in the main workshop. <coughs> yeah. Um, due to the bad weather, there's no point in taking you outside. I'll just show you it working. Now, inside is built to this spec here. The workings of it and the parts list. Should anybody want to? Build one exactly the same. This is found online, incidentally. Um, I do not have the address, but the guy that's actually written the article, Zulu Sierra One, um, Juliet Hotel Golf. So that should help you find it. It's a PDF file available online. Now moving into the workings. Of the actual unit I've built. Um, should it help anybody want to make one? We've got the stainless fittings, uh, the coil, 12, uh, 13 turns of the coil, through a 12 position switch. So basically your transmitter comes in up here on this one and passes into there runs through the switch or the coil depending on how you've um, selected your inductance for the loading and then up through into the capacitor over here comes down into the capacitor and then straight back out to your counterpoise um, the only part anybody may want to know more about is the actual meter side of it well the meter works from this little coil little T50-2 coil, 20 turns literally just slips over the antenna wire sorry, ground wire comes down here, I've actually loaded everything from the diagram onto the back of the potentiometer so we've got our little diode just there capacitor down there and um, runs up through into the back of this old uh, Cybernet meter works a treat it's small enough to go in the little box. This box is 180 mil uh, in width. I can't remember the rest of the di dimensions. But hopefully that will make things easier for people to understand. Should they decide to go ahead with one. So um, obviously the meter side of it. As is shown there. Literally just a capacitor across your potentiometer. As the tails come in. In series there for your diode, I say capacitor across the back. So that's the outside pins of your potentiometer. Centre pin comes out and feeds the positive side of the meter. The negative side is just strapped down to the coil. Very simple thing to make, but very effective. Anyway, maybe we'll be able to do this as a field test at some point with a um, field strength meter and show you how effective it can be. And, and um, I did try it briefly yesterday before the rain came again. And it certainly has a huge effect on getting more out of your antenna. Okay, 73s from 2E0 VOV until the next project.